Hey everyone, this is Osamu Wakabayashi from Zen Ideas. So today's tutorial video is about the CRM system for nonprofit organizations. I usually post lots of WordPress website um, tutorials, but today is about CRM, Cube Drive Flow. Now uh, I'm gonna quickly walk you through how you can import uh, your existing Excel or spreadsheet to our CRM system. This is really handy. So if you're currently using Excel sheet to manage your client data or any uh, data. So I have demo uh, spreadsheet here. Uh, this is an Excel file. And then, uh, so this is a client management system here. And I have the first name, last name, email, and job title and the city states and the number of employees. And then this is a uh, uh, website domain and annual budget and then company founded year. Just imagine that your spreadsheet must be much more complicated than this. You probably have so many columns and then so many rows. You know, I got only 36 uh, on the list, but you might have a thousand or 10,000 client list here. And our system can handle really quickly and easily import your existing spreadsheet data. So let's, let's, uh, let's begin that. Now here, I uh, go to create. And then down here, you said convert Excel to form. Okay, click this. And I'm going to select file. You can drag and drop too, but here, so I'm going to, so I think this is Microsoft Excel. So pick this and then upload. Okay, now go to save. Now here you can map, but uh, the system does that automatic, automatically uh, map the field. Okay, so here's the first name, last name, email and job title, organization, city, states, and number of employees, uh, domain, uh, annual budget, it changed the number. So all the text here, uh, I'm just leave that for now. And actually I can change this text to number, for example, and then click edit and then text to change the number. Okay, and then hit update, save, and also a uh, domain. So that's a, a website URL. So I think we got also URL here. I can change that and hit OK. And then let's create a form here. Okay. And then let's go import data. Okay. So everything looks good. And then so hit go next here. Okay. Hit submit. All right. So 35 total. And then hit the next. And then it's saved, uh, create a new folder here, cube drive flow, Excel migration. So that's a lead list. And let's click that. So as you can see, it, it's all imported. All right. Now, so let's go to the form. So like form design here, I can click this. So it's automatically generated form, okay. Now, so let's kind of go back to uh, my spreadsheet. Now here, the number of employees. So I got the one to 10 and the 11 to 50 and the 51 to 200. And then, so there is like, uh, I have some, I want to create some drop down uh, for this one on the list. So let's go back to form. So here's the number of employees here. Now the field type is now uh, text here. So I'm going to change that. So I'll change this to a uh, single select, okay? And then hit okay. And then right here, so I wanna create a field or a drop down here. So hit add. I put the color, uh, maybe, you know, hit the gray here. So let's keep adding here. I think we got only three choices here, I think here. Okay, so if you have more, you can add that too. But for, for this small spreadsheet, I got only three choices. Okay. And then we can just hit save publish. Okay, start to use here. Uh, oh, you know what? I made a small area here. So it's the one, two. So it has to be, uh, go back here. It has to be exactly the same. So let's try this. Okay, so I use the same language here. So it's a bit tricky here. So now should it be uh, save and publish. 
Now, as you can see, it changed color here. Okay. All right, so actually this annual here, so I need a dollar sign. So I gotta, let's go back to uh, form here. So this is annual budget. Okay, so let's go to, so this is a number. So I should have changed that to um, currency here. Okay, hit okay. And then the symbol, so we have different types of symbols. So now we are uh, gonna just set a United States dollar sign. And then here, this is what it looked like. Okay, so let's uh, hit save. And then let's use that. So now change that here, okay? So you can see how easy uh, for anyone to uh, import from your existing Excel to our CRM system. And updating so much easier compared to Excel. So now let's uh, add this uh, Laura's information here. Just click that. And you can just update all the, um, all the um, field here. So let's say the number of employee uh, this organization increased to, uh, you know, that this 51 to 200 categories, just click, pick one, and then uh, hit save. Okay, and now it changed, right? And then now we create a form here. So if you need to add new client information, just click this add button here. And now you just start filling the form and then it keeps updating. Now, the last thing is I want to show you how to embed this form. So now you can publish this form to your, let's say your website so that you don't have to fill out the form. So maybe your client, you can ask your client to fill out their information directory, right? So let me quickly show that to you now. So we have this iframe uh, code here. And then, uh, so basically you just copy this URL here, command C here, and then just to replace here, iframe source here, you see the uh, between those quotation mark, I'm going to just uh, paste that um, the URL here. You see that? And then let's go ahead and hit publish. And then so let's take a quick look here. I can probably hit. Uh... Now, so you can see now you embedded a form. So now uh, you can ask your client to fill out the forms and then hit submit and then goes to. Uh, actually, let me just do that quickly here. Yeah, let's put uh, some name here. Uh, let's see. Uh, oops. Chris. Uh, All right, so let's just put this data and hit submit. Okay, so it looks like uh, it's been uh, uh, created successfully, submitted, and let's go back to um, spreadsheet here. Not the spreadsheet, sorry, the CRM here, and let's refresh. Now, so new information is added through the iframe form from the website. Okay, so all the data is here. All right, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. This is our new product and the Cube Drive Flow. This is uh, the, the light CRM for nonprofit organizations. And if you are interested, uh, please contact me and then I can personally walk you through our system. And I hope to see you and then thank you for watching. Bye bye.